and gentlemen of boys and girls, you're about to witness a death defying feat. You see behind me a swimming pool, and with it also a high diving, a diving, diving. Oh. Are you? I'm sorry. <laughs> a high diving board. And tonight I will perform a backward, sideways, forward, leading triple somersault before I hit the water. <laughs> oh, yes, I will. Don't start that. <laughs> Before I perform this miracle, I'd like to call upon the assistance of my assistant to assist me. Would you welcome the one and only, the beautiful, the wonderful, Blonder Woman? <laughs> now, I'm very grateful to this marvelous lady here for all the training she's given me. She's taken me through a rigorous training schedule, sometimes seven, eight, even nine days a week. <laughs> Oi, Cooper, man, why don't you show them your equipment? Eh? <laughs> the equipment for the stunt! Oh, right, yes, of course, of course. Now, ladies and gentlemen, you see here... Thank you. <laughs> you see here... a framework which has been built of solid metal iron and steel and it's been structurally structurized to be indestructible who told you that the instructor <laughs> and to prove there is no trickery or fakery involved with this attempt we have here tonight a genuine olympic official can we have the olympic official on please <laughs> yeah. are you a genuine olympic official yes i Sir. Is this a genuine Olympic pool? Yes, it is, sir. And I am a genuine Olympic official. Thank you. And that is a genuine pool. Thank you. And that <laughs> is a genuine Olympic torch. Oh, that's hot, isn't it? <laughs> yes. Thank you. <laughs> I didn't like that gag anyway. <laughs> This is funny, this is funny. I went to the cinema the other day, I went to see that film Jaws, and it was in 3D. Well, I put the glasses on, I was walking down the aisle, and the film was coming towards me, like that. It was coming towards me, it was in 3D. And I bumped into this man, I said, where's the no smoking area? He said, don't ask me, I'm in the film. <laughs> that is a genuine Olympic pool! Thank you. The pool itself is 15 metres in length, and it is 12 metres in width. And the depth is only one and a half metres, so I'll not be diving very deeply. Yep, you mate. What do you want? to check your metres. Uh, <laughs> come on the stairs, then. Hey. I've got a sister who works for the gas board, if you want to meet her. Hold your pack of cards. Pick a card. <laughs> Don't let me see it. Shuffle it. <laughs> now, tear it in half. Tear it in quarters. Tear it in eighths. Now, tear it in... Tear it again. <laughs> Don't let me see it. I stick it back in the pack any way you like. <laughs> I will now pick your card. Is that your card? No. Is that your card? No. You find it. Get up with it! All right, I will do. I will do. <laughs> this is funny. This is funny. <laughs> I got a letter the other day from Bill Bailey. He's not coming home. <laughs> I went to the theatre, you know, I said, I'd like a ticket to see the show. And he said, I'm sorry, we're full up. There's no seats. I said, if Prince Charles came, you'd give him a seat, wouldn't you? He said, of course I would. I said, well, he's not coming, I'll have his. <laughs> I said, how much are the seats? He said, 20 pounds. I said, how much are the programmes? He said, a pound. I said, give a programme, I'll set the programme. <laughs> right, I'm going to take a look aloft. All right. right. Just let me check the pool, first of all. An ordinary handkerchief which I'll place in the pool and it'll come out ringing. <laughs> Thank you. I can see our house from here. <laughs> Have you got any washing on the line? A bra. Was well, a family of gypsies moving in? <laughs> There's a farm over there. I can see it's an old sheep in the farm. How many of them? Just a minute, I'll count one. Two, three, fifteen, <laughs> twenty-four, <laughs> ninety-eight, ninety-nine. Oh, <laughs> <laughs>
Uh, ladies and gentlemen, Cooperman hasn't surfaced yet. Has Cooperman failed? Has he had his chips? Oh, I'll tell you what, I've got a nice bit of fish.